guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to show you how to do a DIY gel pedicure at home. So if you're interested in seeing how I did it, then just continue to watch. So dangerous, I get this new here welcome my name is Juliet. I'm a mom of two boys and I do three videos a week on all sorts I do lots of hauls and fashion and beauty and lifestyle videos so if that's the kind of thing you're interested in there is a little subscribe button down here in red somewhere I would love for you to click that and stick around it's completely free and entirely up to you so without further ado let's get into the video so you all know me by now I like to save a pound or two and having two children under the age of five I find it really difficult to go out and get beauty treatments done very often so I like to do what I can at home and today I'm going to show you how I do my gel toenails now I do it I've done it for years I have to put a disclaimer that I am not a qualified beauty therapist I literally have learned over the years from YouTube videos and tutorials and I just found it really easy and re a great way of saving money so what you are going to need today is a foil, a top coat, a base coat and a gel colour. Now I get mine offline, my top coat and base coat is CND which is shellac and I do have some CND gels but I also really like just cheapo gel, gel nail varnish that you can get off eBay. Um, this one isn't actually even branded and I find that if you get them they're perfectly fine I've never had any damage to my nails so I think as long as the seller has got good reviews definitely would recommend eBay and places like that you are going to need some lint free pads these are just some OPI square lint free squares there are loads in there I don't ooh, there are loads in here I don't even know if it says how many 325 in here and I think I only paid about not even five pounds for them everything i show you today i will try my hardest to link below but i have had these things for a long time and then also you're going to need some cleaning fluid i got this off ebay again it was probably about 10 pounds but i've had this bottle now i would say for at least two three years and i've still got over half left so you don't need a lot but this is amazing. I'll use this and the lint-free wipes in the video. You can, however, use just baby wipes. Baby wipes work just as well, but I didn't actually know that, so I bought cleaning fluid and the lint-free wipes, and because I've got so many, they've just lasted me that long. And then finally, you're gonna need an LED lamp. Now, you might have seen this on my other videos before. It's from Amazon. I think it was about 20 to 30 pounds. I will leave it linked below. I like it because it's pink underneath. But they do do loads of different colors. It's just an LED nail lamp. It's nice and small and compact, but you can get like whole hand under there. So I really, really like this lamp. It does plug into the mains. It normally comes on a it came on a US plug, like a Chinese plug, so you just have to put a UK adapter on, but for like 20 pounds, I mean, that's the sacrifice I've got to make. So let's get started. To start with your nail file, and what you want to do is you want to just neaten up all your toenails. If you need to um, get any more, if there's any more, if there's any remnants of the now varnish that was there before, you want to just get that off and I just like to file them down relatively neat. So they are all nice and uniform. Then what you want to do is you want to take your base coat and you want to pop this on. Now I alternate feet so that I can put one under while I do the other and then you just literally paint it on. Now you want to make sure that you don't go over the cuticle so you want to go down to the cuticle but not onto the skin so if you just put your uv lamp ready and you just pop your foot under for 30 seconds while you do the other foot okay now pop it under the other one and then you want to get your color so i've got my pink and i normally do two coats of color and that is just so it just I put it's better to put on thin coats than one thick coat because then it won't last as well so what I do is I just put on two thinner layers again you want to get right down to the base of your toenail but you don't want to go onto the cuticle and then just 
just swap them over. You only need them under here for 30 seconds at a time, but if it's longer than 30 seconds, it doesn't matter. So what I just do, like you watching me, is I do one and then just keep swapping over. So I just keep it under the lamp as long as it takes me to do the other foot. I think with gel, little is more. So like I say, just do thinner coat. It really doesn't take long at all. And if you're going on holiday and you haven't got time to go and get your nails done, I think this is so easy and so cheap because once you've bought everything, you've got everything for good then. And you could get a lamp, you could get a, an LED lamp and the varnish for the price of having your nails done. So it's a win-win, I think, personally. Okay, so once you've put your two layers on, you want to get your top coat and pop this on. So with your top coat, you want to make sure that you get all the toenail. And also, I like to run it across the ends as well of the toe. And that's just kind of like to seal the color in. is you want to get one of your lint-free squares and then oh got two there just get one of your lint-free squares and you want to get some of your cleaning fluid spray it on and then just literally wipe the nails and that is it it has took me i've just watched on the camera and this has took me eight minutes to do so that is super duper quick and great for holiday i hope you agree so I really hope you enjoyed that video. I hope you're okay with feet. Um, but yeah, I thought I would show you because it's a nice, quick, simple, easy video. And it's just something that I love to do to save myself some money. So I thought I'd share it with you guys. And so I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And I would love for you to subscribe and stick around. And until next time, guys, take care. Bye.